breaking news. Trapped on a train by gushing water. It's a subway soaker in the West Village that could affect your morning rush. Good evening, everyone. I'm Maurice Dubois. Christine is off. The flood blamed on a broken water main showered down on the 14th Street subway station tonight. CBS 2's Valerie Castro live with the ripple effect. Valerie. Maurice, right now, train service for the one, two, and three lines is suspended at this hour, and there is concern that it could affect the morning commute. Right behind me, you can see crews are still working to fix the problem. Commuters captured this cell phone video of water raining down onto a number one train inside the 14th Street subway station. You can see passengers still inside the train car as the water gushes everywhere. Around 6:45, a 12-inch water main broke near 13th Street and 7th Avenue in the West Village. 500 people were evacuated from the train station. It's rush hour. This is a major, major station. It's going to cause a pretty significant inconvenience. Many people found themselves still faced with the suspended train service several hours after it happened. It's just uh, another um, typical inconvenience in New York City. Crews from Con Ed and DEP were already on scene working on another issue when the main broke. There are some questions about whether they may have accidentally hit the pipe. Inside the subway, pumps worked to drain the more than a foot of water that made its way onto the tracks. Fire crews say another concern was possible asbestos contamination in the air. The nearby Lenox Hill Healthplex was also affected. The steam has been uh, dis disconnected from the hospital. It is affecting the hospital at, with that um, utility at this point. The issue also caused a problem for commuters above ground. And also 7th Avenue uh, is completely closed off to traffic. So traffic is backed up way, way, way up 7th Avenue. And at this hour, 7th Avenue clearly remains blocked off. Officials say this will cause problems tomorrow morning. Again, train service for the 1, 2, and 3 right now still suspended at this station. And it's still unclear when those trains will be back up and running, especially in time for the morning commute. Reporting live in the West Village, I'm Valerie Castro, CBS 2 News. Okay, Valerie, thank you.